Okay, so Rahul, let's proceed ahead with your HR for uh, uh, Oil India. So, very brief introduction from your side. Yes, sir. Uh, my full name is Rahul Malhotra, and uh, I was born and brought up in Delhi. And my father is an electrician, and my mother manages home. And I have one elder brother, uh, Sipley. And I did my schooling from Delhi itself. And then I went for my bachelor's in technology in electronics and communication branch uh, from Bharti Vidya Peet Indraprasth University. Then uh, I got an offer in TCS as well as in ONGC MRPL. So I opted for the MRPL as a graduate apprentice trainee in Mangalore. So I went there and uh, worked for seven and a half months. And then I uh, applied for DRDO Debel as a JRF, Junior Research Fellowship, and I got the offer there. As <clears throat> then I shifted to DRDO, and since then I am working here. There. You're and, working uh, as a JRF, right? Yes, sir. Mm. Now oh. SRF. Uh, then uh, right uh, one year back, I also joined uh, in the MTech program offered by Bits Pilani for the working professionals. So I have qualified one year there. One year is left. I'm in the third semester right now. Okay. So, uh, you know, if, what, what will happen to your MTech if you join Oil India? Sir, I have to request to the HRD that, but the classes will be on the weekend itself. If they can allow, um, because work won't be getting affected by that. And uh, a new leave will be required for that, uh, so that I can do it on weekends. If HRD will be so, why you left for... ONGC for DRDO as apprenticeship job? Uh, sir, because apprenticeship was only for the twelve months period. But so you left it after seven months, no? Yes, sir. Because we have to look for the opportunities, sir, before it ends. Mm. So that's why we were actively looking after six months period over. Mm. Then. Uh, I requested the audio that I can uh, complete my apprenticeship, but they didn't allow, so I have to leave. Mm. So, so what did you learn in uh, ONGC? Sir, in ONGC, I explored that uh, how uh, how big can Indian industries be, and uh, refineries. Uh, uh, after my graduation, I have never been to industry, so I I got to know that uh, how instrumentation, basic PID control, how it works on the large scale. Mm -hmm. uh, and the refining refinery, how they work, how and uh, instrumentation part, how the signal uh, comes from the field and gets uh, processed, and logics works there. Mm. What is the okay, so so Rahul? Now, what do you know about Oil India? Oil India is a Navaratan company, sir, uh, and it started from the Assam location, mm. and uh, it is having a field headquarters in Assam. And uh, Sushil Chandra Mishra, uh, Sushil Chandra Mishra is a CMD of Oil India Limited, mm -hmm. and uh, it is the second most largest company in India mm -hmm. uh, for the oil and natural gas production and exploration. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, it is also in the renewable energy production of 188 megawatts. In which, uh, feed as, so. as electronics and communication engineer, how do you justify your uh, uh, activities and jobs and profiles in oil company? So, as an electronics engineer, uh, there is a vast, uh, vast uh, scope in the in oil industries itself because mm -hmm. the instrumentation part plays a major role in the controlling and the safety aspects of the plant. Okay. And uh, as we as I know that DCS PLC systems are uh, there, mm -hmm. and uh, how much more R and D work we can uh, involve with the companies Honeywell and mm -hmm. so many other companies are there. So we can um, make a good safety aspects related to uh, mm -hmm. plants. Rahul, do, uh, do you find a scope of these companies while well, companies? Uh, knowing well that uh, fossil fuel based uh, technology is not sustainable so, uh, it's never like uh, that something can be completely annihilated which has survived over a long past year mm -hmm. 
it's like uh, when uh, when in 2002 cng also introduced <coughs> the, uh, people were thinking that cng uh, might replace all the petroleum cars and all and uh, if you say so uh, it's like uh, the proportion will be shifted Uh, electronic vehicles will come but it doesn't mean ki it will eliminate sir and other aspects are coming now they are thinking very wisely and shifting to renewable energy also mm-hmm. so same companies uh, profit margin will shift that's it but uh, see sir change is the uh, only constant sir so all have to survive okay any idea about uh, what are the objectives government of india has kept for itself uh, as far as renewable energy is concerned Uh, sir, three hundred mega, three uh, hundred gigawatt energy. Ah, uh, three. Th- uh, I am not aware about that. Are you aware about COP, Conference of Parties? C- COP summit. Are you aware about that, Rahul? No idea, right? Okay. So, Rahul, now uh, tell me, uh, what are your hobbies? Sir, I love to play badminton. Okay. And uh, I used to do mandala mandala drawings. What is that? Ah, uh, sir, so it's like a printed sketch, black and white sketch will be there, and uh, you have to just color it. Uh, sketch there. It's an adult coloring book, sir. Uh, it's like uh, it's like this, sir. It will be black and white, and uh, like this, it will be black and white, and then you can color them. Okay, like but uh, from where you get these uh, uh, prints? Uh, so this full booklet we can get from the stationery, and then we. And you only uh, do colors in that, ah? Huh? Yes, sir. So, but that is that is not that is your hobby, yeah? That the kids do in the school. Yeah, it's it's the बच्चों की कॉपियाँ आती हैं ना वो? Yeah, sir. It's uh, soothing, sir. Uh, you can play the song and keep your coffee with you, and then uh, keep on coloring. नहीं वो बच्चे नहीं करते स्कूल में हाउ दैट दिस इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम दैट आ सर इट्स नो वे डिफरेंट फ्रॉम दैट इट्स लाइक मोर प्रिसीजन इज देयर सर इन दैट अगर तुम छोटे बच्चों के साथ करोगे तो दे विल बी वेरी हैप्पी आई आई डोंट थिंक वो भी साथ में तुम्हारे करने लगेंगे राइट सर एक्चुअली इट इज डिजाइन फॉर द एडल्ट्स इट नेम इज एडल्ट कलरिंग बुक सो इट्स वेरी प्रिसाइज दैट इज माय क्वेश्चन हाउ इट इज डिफरेंट फॉर एडल्ट्स इफ आई गिव दिस बुक टू किड Actually, I have given it to kids, sir, and I can show what he has blunder he has done here, sir. But he's enjoying, time, right? It is yeah, more than doing to the kids. For mandala drawing, I just wanted to tell you is that it is very precise. And what do you? What I mean by precision is that you have to concentrate over that so that you won't think. At least, so it comes out as a meditative session because you will be. In, involved in the activity and you won't be thinking for that much time mm-hmm. so that's how it uh, gives a soothing sensation okay let me give you the feedback now rahul when is your interview uh, sir most probably february and march sir okay theek hai abhi kya hai tumhara jo flow hai thoda sa uh, kam hai to matlab thoda speed pace up karna padega thoda sa zyada aur uh, aap mandala drawing ke upar aur bits planning ki mtech ke upar अपना रख सकते हैं कि सर मेरा इंटर्नशिप रहा है ओएनजी में उसके बाद मैं डीआरडी में ज्वाइन कर लिया प्रेजेंटली आई एम डूइंग माय जेआरएफ इन एसआरएफ इन डीआरडीओ अलोंग विद माय एमटेक यस सर एंड हॉबीज में ये ड्राइंग में से वो क्वेश्चन पूछ सकता है राइट right? और थोड़ा सा पेस इंक्रीज करना पड़ेगा और जो मैं क्वेश्चन पूछता पूछ रहा हूँ तुमसे वो लिखते चले जाना कॉपी के ऊपर अभी जैसे कॉपी लगा लो एक डेडिकेटेड जो जो एच आर आपसे पूछे जा रहे हैं उनको नोट करते रहना Yes, they are the probable questions uh, somebody can uh, they ask you right yes sir samajh gaye aur isme jaise yehi question ke to bacche karte hain yaar to kya answer dhoondoge ab iska understood badminton yes, khelta hu wo to bahut log bolte hain unko interest nahi hai usme they may not ask anything the moment you say mandala drawing mandala drawing if i'm pronouncing it properly mandala drawing karta hu main to fir wo usme se question puchhenge kya hota hai bhai batao kya hai kaisa nahi hai Did I answer correctly, sir? No, it's okay. But um, I asked you questions, so you need to convince them. कि बच्चे भी तो यही करते हैं तो तुम्हारा लग कैसे है? तो वो question पूछेगा ना तुमसे वो? उसका answer ढूंढो अभी क्या हो सकता है? Yes. Right. So note करते जाओ and keep finding the answers to 
वट क्वेश्चन वर आस्ट टू यू हॉबीज में से क्या पूछे गए आपसे एच आर में से क्या पूछे गए इंट्रोडक्शन वॉज ओके एंड देन दे माइट आस्क यू क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम योर एम टेक की एम टेक का क्या होगा वो छोड़ दोगे एज इलेक्ट्रॉनिक इंजीनियर ऑयल कंपनी में क्या काम करोगे तो ये तो क्वेश्चन है प्रोबेबल जो मैंने तुमसे पूछे इनका आंसर ढूंढने की ट्राई करो अभी कैसे कैसे आंसर आएगा क्योंकि ये एक्चुअल ऑयल कंपनीज के क्वेश्चन है जो भी मैं पूछ रहा हूँ वो ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ वट फीडबैक स्टूडेंट गिव राइट Yes, so uh, that is how so you should know ki yaar these are the probable questions which can be asked to me yes sir that is what we are predicting right yes sir so you should be convinced ki ha main ye answer karunga uska yes sir. and i tell you there can be no good right answer or wrong answer yes. it is whether you convince them and before you convince them you need to convince yourself yes. done it rahul yes yes sir chalo then uh, keep going for some more hrs as and when you are ready right yes sir when shall i come for the next maybe after two days okay on sunday i'll see